So you've got four minutes to pitch your business. The four minutes starts now. My name is Peter Mugaudu and I'm from the company called Moving Board. You need to get to what you want the money for. You're running All out right. of time. I think you're stuck in this odd space yeah. between promoter mm -hmm. and traditional yeah. advertising. It's this weird kind of in the middle space. In South African advertising market, yes, zinga zezin kunda, ezin kula ga kuluge, kesi ni sfini ne si shesham. Pela gelana yabo na ezin kampani zizama mktola ezin jela, eza suga suga ne zoguti zigua zoguga ya amakasment. Si kulu malala nge fast broadband. Hina ni labantu kaba seven zisa yonage internet. Footy no kwetla ge wente ngo yok seven zisa internet. Yes, zinga gezezin to ezin zoguti ge Sunday sibalo. Nende labantu kaba advertise anga kon. O Peter. Wamu nye basu mapiz, nisa ba kole la ukutike yana, anga kukula indele advertising. Kienzo anga kona guli lagiti. Namsanje we making moves. Si funa ngende la enge asha eyo advertise. Ebi zwangu kutiwa yi moving billboards. Moving board is a company that deals with a unique marketing and promotion element platform that we call moving billboard. Si tata uhambo saya epulu kwa ne eli mpoku. Ukiyo kita usugu na ayo umpatuwe moving billboards. Upita muka uutu. Sapinde sazi gabanzi kwa kutile business like ulusungu lega njaa. Later, he visits our studios to share his vision and plan to spread his business into other provinces. Hi, my name is Peter Mukaudu, the owner and the founder of uh, Moving Board South Africa. Moving Board is a company that deals with a unique marketing and promotion element platform that we call Moving Billboard that can go direct to your target market. It gives you the element of a promoter and uh, it can pass your message directly with a word of mouth and again advertising. Moving Billboard is a new platform, Eric Lissemo South Africa, which is a very good promoter and an element of a promoter. So, we have a promoter that has a billboard that has a billboard. So, we have a new platform. And I mean, if it's a hint or it's an idea or it ends in South Africa. Mm -hmm. And from research around that area, you know, the idea of winning or travel overseas. Yeah. Tell us a bit about that and how or it is it a drunk more high. Yeah, the one who oversee moving billboard, only one yeah advertising space, feeling very attractive. And it's uh, a So it's a hike one that we can go 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 Hotla Joan Hore, come South Africa, and a little old stationary billboard. Hang at Lisa, this billboard, come South Africa, regards a job creation, recreate a youth around America, and a Rohone Lo Fadit line setting another innovation media platform, Etla Hona Huisa Product Governor, Kova 2, direct. Nolo izi na horu iki sentu yu moko kai. Kaba nito za peshe ya pe, lagu lulu ti fiye laikai. Na hole very difficult. Eski tu wako femeling e, e adikubo di kutu ani. And I had hore, ki bereke hati, ibatla masheleng amanchi. Nkono waka amfa masheleng, aku injekta hore ki kipe ho rakadi raiti za moving board overseas. Ay, ashone kuna ke puti. Yashi sara ipulu kwa ni. Thank you. Yeah, no, no, no. After you, man. All right. This side, we have a final product. We have paste a like a workshop area, like we paste boards, printing, and all those things. We print all those things. Yeah. 
encouragement that we learn from the moving billboard in Tlaitla Bereka, is that we plan in South Africa as we adopt other things, encourage us to to use public transport, walking, and everything, and studying again lifestyle in South Africa. Most of the commune people, or most of the but, but we require public transport and kiko baling bangatakote. You know, I mean, I, I met him through uh, some of the people that I, I, I trust. I didn't even know. So I a young guy with a lot of ideas, you know, who could take over the world. But obviously he needed support or uh, how do we go about certain things. He always comes up with something interesting, something new. You know, he may not know how to, to make it work, but he always comes up with something interesting. One frustrator, because he's got a lot of ideas, that's what happens with people with ideas or frustrator. He wants something new, and then you can't have everything new, you know, at the same time, so. There's a level out about regress support, and there's a level out hey, what's about this is new, you have to keep pushing until, but why I mean, it's new for everybody, but, Re, 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 we are confident or we are, we are in the right direction and we are going to Here we are ready to do the, the Department of Health uh, campaign yeah. for, for Nutrition Week. Yeah. So this is the process, this is our promoters. They are on uniform and now we are about to hit the street. Yeah. Because, yeah, they are not moving board. Oh, now we're going direct to the people. Yeah. They are not stationary. The company moving billboards about two years ago. The company was at a dealership. The company was at Peter. I was at the same time. 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 And that's where Halaga forge a relationship. Abti Peter, kimo tunga no amitla i impa unale na kora hard letter inza kwebo. So e hai seveza hand. Kimo chana lidi idea tanga da nining okay zeding hard seveza but bohulo baso na dia seveza so ki kitapa or even going forward he's gonna go far. My my past dad was a was a businessman, so. And as a business, so a family encourages or no, follow in your footstep of your father as a businessman. So, you want to encourage the family, encourage the whole, Keska Pelaka, Kamant, and Salar. Yeah, that's it. Are you making that kind of return on your money? Uh, we're making that kind of a return, but uh, as a tiny raindrop in the ocean. Advert, Growing up, our life was not uh, okay. Just imagine, five years old, you don't have a dad, you don't stay with your mom. Mama how uko jobe kiko makhoe, and uh, going to school sometimes it was difficult because lady kaku about nakama winter kodi kaku ngoko something. And after the papa had huko falla ahead hori kibatse baneli mewaka ko Alexander. In a small place, it was a bachelor flat. Nandu lady flatting, nani kiri la kamola? Seven London Road. I went to Minerva High School. He went to Alex High. So we've known each other for like then we were not together. Nere hari mama and take a lesson and take a road to reke. Ngaso reke li label. I can afford ho ho reke la dilosa label. Itla rechelo hudi le. 
wena wa itekela di aparutso di batlang tsa label ka tsomo go ora di switi le le ntshena ke di regisa go skolo then na o gona ka on the site ka di weekend na regisa thapa wa ke motuso regisa thapa wa he had to be a man at an early age because i think he started doing part time jobs while he was very young about 12 13 you know so i think he became responsible at a very early age ka the age of 16 ka tola mmero ko nyana ko ko mama kana ba ka ko teng na ile skolo so ba pega bosigo ba da wa fetso pega di students a di fetso ja ko za gona anyone so na ke ya ko ko mmero ko ngole ke lo tlhatswa di 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 kotlolo tsa bana ba mpatela 20 rand an hour so na ke ba ka 3 hours bosigo but um, that's what made him a man. Ya Thomas ke batla maele ko le ko ke focus ko ko education ya ka gore ke fetse gore ke be accountant ke antse ke ya ke ya ke ya le le post ene ke ke tshola batho ba bang ba mfa project ta gore ke tlo ba etse tsa philippi study ya ya go ba tlisa dealership brand kamo ya di koloi ba mfa contractor ka tshoma go tla ka mo limpopo ke ga ke tlwaela limpopo ha ntse go ya go ya ba fetse mpatala that's when car ai south africa high fell limo e re ke bona di naga tse ko ntle gore wa tsa galang i'm still young so e re ke ya ko ntle ke ke bona go tsa galang then ha ke tla ko ntle ke ntse ke le ko ntle ko ko mo seja then khalwatle ka khatlana le company e e ke rana gona no moving board and then one day ke han tharoetse mama e kreile a contract ya go oversee ya advertise then go oversee ba mora ba re re tlo go romela di di board the advertising by the rumela di bo di bota the advertising and then the baba tlam show bo 450000 go ntsa di bota tse ha di fitla ko airport ha na chele it was another struggle hard for us as a family we just had to support him but as i'm saying or it hasn't been easy because of uh, it wasn't bringing money something that I love about him. He, he's a hustler. He, he doesn't give up. What makes me happy is spending time now with my kids and uh, with my family and able to, to have uh, a successful relationship with my kids and my family. Soma business abaningi ba sisi ba kulu mango guti ba ge ba pega na ganja nezi mnam futi nangu tiba ba kukula ganja ni ge zimpi losa upit wamu nyenge ba bogo la ba soma business lenti zogo amele guti ifale ge business la kelo guti goba enga boni gasoline no master nde wake namtla njenge lenti zwa inati ogusto kela guti wa kukula ganja ni ge zimpi loyaki waleta nezi mtla mtla ganja ni ge mdeni no wake na se business inla ke I'm in the studio of making moves. I'm very nervous. I'm going to see uh, Pepsi. I don't know what is in for my business, but I hope it's good. Uh, getting good coaches here and uh, good advices. But I'm here. I'm very nervous all the way from Limpopo. Advertising and media are cutthroat businesses. However, Peter Mukawutu seeks to revolutionize the South African sector from its traditional old ways. What is unique about Peter's advertising idea? Let's find out. Here he is to enlighten us. Take a seat, man. Thank you, sir. So, Utswa, all the way from Polokwan. Yeah, it's all to, the way from Polokwan. To come and be on Making Moves today. Yeah, Making okay. Moves, thank you. Fantastic. Welcome to the show. Thanks a lot, sir. All right, so let's go straight into the business. Um, Naturally, we don't disclose figures, mm -hmm. but we were working out, Jorge, what kind of profit you've got to make 
in order to start making a return on your money. Yes. Um, are you making that kind of return on your money? Uh, we're making that kind of a return, but uh, as a tiny raindrop in the ocean. Uh, it's a new medium. Uh, most of agents, they don't know about it. Most of uh, brands, they don't know about it. We're still trying to prove ourselves. Marais, when you want to make it a vice on the billboard, carry van, for instance, the carry trailer. How is this different? Because that can also move from one place to another. All right. The, the difference is with us, as uh, it gives it an element of uh, a person carrying it. So you're not just getting a picture on the road for a person to do that. You can ask our billboard question, and it can interact with you and. The benefit to that client, it gives you even the, the feedback where that client, we do, you can do, you can use our bots as a survey because we get the statistics for you after we give you the, the oh, report. So, 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 research, research these yeah. billboards, okay. So we want to yeah, guide in, where did you see this idea? I saw it in, in Croatia. Okay. Uh, but they are, they're mainly in, in Germany. Their headquarters are in Germany. Okay, so I'm trying to understand now if this is going to pick up at a medium, because you're competing mm. with uh, the likes of Commuternet, uh. um, Creative Council, all these people that do the activation or the promotion, um, Modikolong, Taxi Ranks, etc., etc. Mm. So you're competing with these guys, and I'm still not convinced, Hori, these moving billboards are unique enough. Mm -hmm. So why can't I make my own billboard that's a moving billboard? Uh, the moving billboard, that's why I said I saw the idea in Croatia, then the headquarters they are in, uh, in Germany. It's been painted under WIPO. Mm. And uh, South Africa is, uh, is one country that is uh, bind by the, by the by WIPO standards. So yeah. I can't go and just open, yeah. do my own moving, moving billboard. billboard. Yeah. You can't do that. Uh, the only country that I know of that can do their own billboard is is China because they are not under WIPO. They are not governed under WIPO, so they can implement anything at any time. Mo Nigeria? Ah, Nigerians, you can't do that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So that's secure. Mm -hmm. What do you think it's going to take to get this business to the next level? For it to become as common as the billboards in Bonang when you're driving on the highway? Uh, what's going to take to make it uh, more? Uh, like where's the growth? And where's how the growth? You, how are you going to achieve right. that growth? All uh, right, it, it gives you the element of where other activations but used to go. How are you going to grow it? Like what's 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 happening? How are you going to take it right. from where it is today to where it's, you want it to get to? Is uh, is signing up uh, 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 signing up areas to give clients more uh, areas where they are their brands will be. Events is one of them. Uh, areas like uh, Park Station, like all the stations in South Africa, uh, signing up all the beach in, uh, in South Africa. There's no other medium that can do better activation than us at the beach and everything. Let's say we take uh, skin cancer education because our board is educational, gives you the element of, mm -hmm. of educating. Mm -hmm. If you don't want to take a flyer, you can see it's written. So, it makes a different, just a human element that all those competitors they have. See, and I think that's where the magic yeah. is. The magic is in turning it into an activation idea. Yeah. So to say, okay, go park station or train stations all over the country. These are the kinds of products that we think we can sell. Mm -hmm. And we have promoters walking around mm -hmm. and talking to people mm -hmm. and they've got these billboards. I love the beach idea. Yeah. I love the idea, Yadi event and whatnot. Mm -hmm. So how far are you from rolling that out? Uh, we're, not, we're not that far apart. Uh, we already signed some few malls in Limpopo. Uh, we signed uh, Santin uh, Central. My concern is, I don't think the business is making money right now. Exactly. Right. And I don't know how much you've got left in your tank to continue running with this thing and whether you're going to run out of steam before it blows. You know, they say the pioneers are always the ones that yeah. end up with the arrows on their backs. Exactly. And the guy that comes after is the one that benefits. Benefits, yeah. So I'm going to send you off for a coaching session and yeah. then 
you know, you'll be helped to mold some of your thinking and some of your responses for tomorrow. And then I look forward to seeing you tomorrow when you pitch. Okay, thanks a lot. Sir. Thank you, Chaka. Great. Sharp, sharp. Okay. Great. South Africa needs more young pioneering entrepreneurs just like Peter with innovative ideas that will lead the way. I'm going to pair Peter with a like-minded coach who will help him move his business forward. Um, 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 um highlighted is some of the things that are twenty business like idiots and Lina ki kona ko ko bua ka din chote twenty idiots in a business and an otlu ite oton romela ko coaching section. I'm expecting to learn a lot from from that session, and I'm open to to know more things that uh, my coach will 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 break for my business. And um, your current marketing strategy. Talk to me about that. My current marketing strategy, uh, what I do now is... Uh, 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 Making room. Making room. Ukuba nesu le business, hinto e ntlege leyo. Goto munga sebe nzi ngo kuluguz, misela guze business la koli pumelele. No mama pupo ako ga fezek. Ayo nga manu sale pants, uwa bugele, e shabalan. Upita. Yenye yezi nsizu wake sebe nza nko kulu guzi misele. Njongo bage pelese tate ama steps ambalwa uguza afeza ama pupaki. Kwa ze business. Tina gela kwa make moves. Sifunu kwa ibona gele nsizu wa ipumelele. Yinga hako kesi ilanga nisenu mkakresh. Ozo msiza glulu hambu lwaki. Loza ma business. My name is Lefa Mahoro. I'm the sole director of Kloro Kholu and Trading. It's a private organization that was registered in 2013. For me, mentoring, it's about the passion for the people. It's about being ability to be honest and true. Because when you mentor, it's, it's not about making friends with the mentee about the business. You need to be true, frank, and honest. My value would be my contacts. I've got uh, different people that I know that I've done a lot of things with from different sectors. So that is my core failure. My business motto, it's quite simple and straightforward, is just do it now. Don't wait, just do it now. How's the business? Uh, the business is uh, is doing well and not doing well. It's got its own challenges. It's got its own challenges. Okay. Yeah. yeah. What kind of challenges are you confronted with? Uh, introducing the new medium okay. into 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 our country. Right. And uh, old fashioned uh, advertising agencies and brands that they are used to the old fashioned medium okay. that uh, is standard. Oh. First impression, Linda Telefa. Nagitsuhile. Mara. Ang. Ang Keta Hori give a welcome and they give it openly. And so, Linda Telefa, I think, is a, is a good guy. Currently, who, who are the the, your clients? Uh, uh, currently, I'll say most... Uh, in public sector and public private sector. sector? Is a public sector, uh, we're talking about government, okay. uh, Department of Health. I'm doing more of, uh, of campaigns for them because okay. our boards, they're more educational oh. and it can go direct to, to the target market that the government needs or the client needs. Okay. Uh, private sector, we we doing we did pick and pay, and we're still doing pick oh, and nice. pay as well. Oh, nice. Uh, when they're opening the store, we're doing activation, like open now, pick and pay open now, oh. or pick and pay open in tomorrow. And you said you have to sign up with sites for you to for your people to be able to display whatever is being advertised. Yeah. And how's that going? How many sites have you have you signed up? Uh, now, as as we signed a few of the sites. Uh, we are busy trying to get how train because most of the traffic. pub traffic now sure. uses how train stations right. and everything, so we can do more activations on the, the, the how train station. The Ngare di Botsarena, di Tswana Lee, Batwaba, Emango di Robotong, 
pakentse di pipi ga ngitla o crea batho ba fa di flyers ko santin cause ba re ba ba ntse di regulations sa bona gore ha gona motho o tlo fa ni flyers so media wa rena o ka gona go kena ka mo santin o move fela around because is a billboard that is moving around uh park station Gold Reef okay. City, right. Asantin City Central. We're trying even to get them because there's lots of uh, events or or exhibition within Santin Convitional Center, sure. but there's no any billboards that can direct the feet to to Santin Convitional Center. So if the boards they are moving around Santin Central, and there's an event that is happening in Santin, the, yeah. the, the organization get a yeah. get a desired exposure. Exposure. Um, I. I went through your your business model, <clears throat> and there's a couple of um, one or two risks that I've identified. How do you deal with the issue of weather? Because I would imagine if it's raining, it, it can be a challenge. Am I, am I right? Yeah, it is a challenge. If it's raining. Uh, there's no point for you to advertise or to take your brand mm. on the streets mm. because most of people they are more careful even driving drivers on the on the roads they are more careful and like looking at their advertising billboards so mm. advertising people that advertise in that point of time using those stationary billboards they're losing mm. the the value for money mm. so with us when it's rain we hold back those hours of advertising and give and it to the client yeah, later. later. Okay. They're moving around. I would imagine they're exposed to be possibly bumped by cars. Uh, what kind of measure do you have in place to to ensure that th th that risk is it's managed? Uh, in that measure, any campaign that we're doing, we we get public uh, insurance. Oh, yeah. so, so you've that, got insurance, yeah, in, insurance place like ensure in place to ensure that to ensure everyone that gets head in the car then we are covered of covered on that covered yeah okay and um your current marketing strategy talk to me about that my current marketing strategy uh what i do now is uh i have two guys and and myself that uh, that uh, that are doing marketing right. and uh, to go to the clients and everything in most of the cases i had to give away our services for free Okay. so that to prove ourselves to prove our medium so we're doing that so to get more brands mm. into 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 us yeah i'm glad that you are you have you've realized that it's not sustainable yeah. you can only do so much mm -hmm. uh so i think we'll we'll definitely have to look in that in in details to say how else can we make it uh, we need to bank it's time to bank exactly um otherwise i think it's a it's a good product um you, I like the fact that you have identified already areas the where there's challenges, and like I said, I think there's a need to revisit the the marketing strategy, so that we we start to bank because the rate at the rate that it's going, uh, the risk exposure it's it's high, mm. so um, we will we will definitely look at that, uh, but otherwise don't doubt your product. Uh, I like the product. I think most organization, if it's pitched well and positioned well, that they, they are likely to to buy into it. But otherwise, I'm I'm comfortable with 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 where things are. But we just need to look at relook at a few things, including the marketing strategy. Right. He must first show us the product, the billboard itself, and highlight the value that the billboard can can add. And the best way to position yourself and say competitors cannot do X, Y, Z. So there's a need for research. Nikki Moves has a prize valued at 50,000 rand to invest into a business. 12 young entrepreneurs will get a chance to showcase their businesses. Each entrepreneur will be given a chance to pitch for this investment to our panel of judges. The judges will use their own discretion to pick the top four businesses to go into our final episode where they will compete for this grand prize. You too can be part of this exciting opportunity for young entrepreneurs. Skim, so, 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 so. Okay, so, so, so. I'm not. 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 I'm
Inkundlu kiyo nage ngitu kia hama kasme ndu ya shanje ipichi. Ukuta bantu bafage imali o indaba itemba kwe ni brandi abu. Ukutu zoka zi kutu i-advertise. Yes sir. Will you be able ukutu ugu nzege logo nala? Uh, this is a different stage. Mm -hmm. uh, I have now to pitch my business mm -hmm. to, to the judges mm -hmm. so they can judge my business. In that mm -hmm. lines, I pitch the ideology yeah. of the, uh, to carry their brand. But mm -hmm. this is a different stage. I'm a bit nervous. Yeah, but I um, think I'm ready. All right. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Jongo bage nzi zoe si shilo guti uyapona umenga be picha kuma client usuge ee na geyo kangisa nge business lake esho guti utinga in umefugu wage manji upicha la macha chisezu ama tatu upicha la ugutika angene kuisikaba eslandi layo kwa zibani mkambege futi ngaba uyena kwa basenta nge nugutika upicha lege na uge liyo 50,000 rand kwa tu wangapamu kwa ugonke loko agensi pone uguti le picha le nzi zoe hamba ganjani macha chisa ama tatu amlindi Good afternoon. Welcome back to Making Moves. Afternoon, sir. How are you? Uh, no, I'm all right. Yeah, 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 that's a, that's a trick. Bigger, but very light. Okay, it's very light. It's not heavy. It's not heavy. Okay. So you've got four minutes to pitch your business. The four minutes starts now. All right. Um, my name is Peter Mugautu, and I'm from the company called Moving Board the new system of advertising and the platform that can go where other mediums cannot go. And uh, moving board, the uniqueness about moving board is, uh, is, is in two. It gives you the element of a promoter and is a talking billboard. And we go direct to the target market. We are not the old stationary boring billboards. So if at lines need a certain SLMM, uh, target market, we can go direct to it without wasting any uh, rent value in advertising, but directing to the right target audience for the brand at any time, at any day. At night, our bots illuminate, so you give us a night campaign, we can able to be visible. You give us a day, night, a day campaign, we can able to, to go to the direct target. The only Problem is when it's raining, most of the brands or most of the clients they don't know that they're losing the value in, in, in advertising because there's no much commune or there's no much traffic or audience to look at the advert. So with us, we can stop that advert and give you the hours that you paid for in the day where the commune or the target market that you're looking for, they are on the streets and flexible to talk to them. And moving board, because it's got an element of, uh, of talking, so we can collect uh, available information for your product. You can use us as a, uh, as a research advertising. And again, you can use us as a, as a statistic. If you want to know more about your product, that's the element of what moving board is using and what they're different about moving board holistically. So, we can advertise in front. As you can see, we are visible. Then the advert goes at the back as well. So you can able to do that. As of now, South Africa, there's lots of traffic and lots of interjections at certain hours. That's where Moving God gives you value. In those certain hours, you can catch those guys while they are frustrated in traffic and everything and give them something that they can buy or or advertise your product in there. There are many uh, places where moving body signing places, like Hull Train, where there's lots of traffic. We can do activations there. We can do uh, activation in park stations where there's lots of cumin. Um, you need to get to what you want the money for. You're running right. out of time. Okay, uh, <clears throat> we need the money to, to do that. We are, we, are, we are the only one in the whole of Southern Africa with the, with the paint and ride from WIPO. But the paint and ride, we have now to do territorial rights. Territorial right, it gives us the right to be 
in southern Africa to know that now we are in South Africa. This is the territorial right. So territorial right, we do it uh, with uh, the, the attorneys. So, and it costs a lot, because the best attorneys uh, that can handle the, the patent, they cost lots of money. So with the money, we'll use it to, to expand the, our, to inject it in, into our, our patent right, territorial right, and again, advertise it in newspaper so that this is not just a copycat that you wake up and you can copy it. It's patent, and we are, have a backup with the patent right for territorial South Africa. Okay, thank you very much, sir. So the patent is only for South Africa. You want the money in order to expand the patent to make it Southern African. Uh, no, the, the patent, moving board is patent for the whole world. But the, the money that we're looking for is to get the territorial rights so that the DTI can able to acknowledge moving board in South Africa will be known as the only medium that is uh, designated for South Africa. Okay, Martin? I, I, I'm still not understanding where the commercial value lies. Please help me understand where you're going to be making money. Yes, you're saying that all agencies will have to talk to you. Mm -hmm. But would you, would you still have to do the marketing around these moving boards? The, the marketing around marketing moving board yes. itself as yes. a platform? Yes. Yes. Okay, so you, you'll right. still be responsible for that. We'll be and they would still want to need you. Yeah. What stops them from doing... It doesn't have to be exactly the same, but yeah. something very similar. Moving Board is the only company that has the right to advertise in this kind of billboard, the Moving Billboard. Anything that is close to billboard is stepping on the patent. That's why <coughs> the territorial right, they are much more important, mm. so that any imitation or any close by to this, then when we take it to our attorneys and they find signage within that copycat, then we can able to do a lawsuit. So you're saying nobody will be able to come close nobody to Nobody will okay. be able to do okay. that. Okay, thanks, you've answered my Thank question. Uh, same individuals that are carrying the, the board, do you, do you have some form of insurance for them? Because they're exposed to be hit by cars or anything, or there's possible hazards and perils. Yeah, that, that, that is a, a good question, and that is a first priority. Every event that we do, there's an insurance that we call public insurance. Yeah, so it's... we first go and do the public insurance, and we analyze the risk. Let's say we do the event in the stadium. We analyze the risk, and, and we do training before, that we know that we get fit guys or fit ladies that to do that kind of activation. Okay. Thank you very much, sir. We're going to deliberate for a few minutes, call you back and potentially give you some tasks and talk about the way forward. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, it was nerve breaking, uh, but I think we did well to present myself and my company. And uh, yeah, we, we will see. And I uh, believe that the judges, they are more knowledgeable in coming to painting and advertising um, uh, scenarios and how that uh, the laws and everything works. Lefa, this was your man. You mentored and coached him. So I'll start with you. What do you think? I think it's um, the product. It's it's it, it's gone up trade in a very high competitive environment. And I'm not sure if South African market particularly is ready to throw money at a moving product like his. I, I'm not understand, I, I don't understand where, again for me, like I said to him, if he, if he fully understands the commercial value of it. Because the territorial rights, again, is going to be quite a big, it's not going to cost 50,000 rand to get territorial sure. rights. Sure. It's sure. quite expensive to get territorial rights. So again, like Lifa just said, for me, it's again a huge capital injection. And 
the recoup of that money is going to take far too long. Well, based on his current exactly. numbers. Exactly. Yeah. Put. Here we go. It was tough. Nerve breaking. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But uh, I guess it went well. You guess it went well? Yeah. You know, my, my problem with this business is that he's, he's sitting in this weird space between billboard. Now, for a half decent billboard, I'm paying 50 grand a month mm. as a brand, sure. right? Yes. Um, and promoters. Mm. Right. That's kind of, a, he's sitting mm. in an yeah. odd space because a mm. promoter wearing a billboard, a branded mm. clothing, mm. handing out pamphlets mm. and talking and doing sampling similar and that exposure. kind of stuff. Mm. It's similar exposure. Mm. And instead of paying five grand, I'm paying a grand per promoter. Mm. Yeah, it's a, it's a tricky one because uh, numbers don't lie and numbers are telling us the story. And numbers of story of three years. Mm. Mm. And for me, the task would be attached to how you can diversify. I'm not sure that there can be any diversification mm. from, in his from current, this, yeah. yeah. The only diversification that comes to mind would possibly be pitching to both public sector and private sector. Which, which he is doing, though. He's which he's doing. He's, he is pitching to okay. both the public mm. sector okay. mm. and, and mm. the private sector. And how's that yeah. going? Well, I mean, his numbers say how mm. it's going. So it's not going well then? No. <laughs> yeah. Mm. I think he's a solid entrepreneur. Yes. No, no, he's sure. a really smart yes. guy. Absolutely. Right. And I think he's got a bright future. Yeah. I'm just not sure that this is the, the best. Product, I was yeah. just going to say, this yeah. product, yeah. Does, I'm not sure that it speaks to him okay. as an entrepreneur. Mm. All right. Please bring him back in. So we start to go to Uyo Zompumela Wako Gututin from Amachachi's Way. Uzizwa Ranjan, how do you feel about Bazutin? Uh, I'm not sure, but I'm confident with my pitching. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, I will hear what they will tell me. Give over. Yeah. Uh, it was worth it. Uh, it was worth it. Yes. Uh, and again, uh, I'm not sure. But i And again, I don't know the point of the judges. Yeah. Uh, but I think I presented my company and myself very well. Mm -hmm. yeah. If you had another chance, chance. I guess born ago, good to get back moving billboards. In Cabena, Naboga, Bassa move and not. Uga was in his cab. No magic car, who humble up, sell clean like a corner. I guess it's Peter. Welcome back. Thanks a lot, sir. Firstly, thank you for your patience. It's been a very long day. <laughs> you are a very committed entrepreneur. In fact, you're one of the most committed entrepreneurs that I've ever come across. You're a hardworking guy. You've got an instinct mm -hmm. with your first business, which failed not because you did anything. And with the second business, you saw something that nobody else has seen before. You are going to make a lot of money whatever you end up doing. So just some feedback. Lefa, have you got any feedback? Yes. Um, my feedback, it says, we, Peter, you need to concentrate on your, you need to double check your pricing. Um, and this is, this is a, it's a normal, it, it, it's normal that when product is new or you don't have, you don't have anyone to benchmark your price with. So you, you never know if you are rightly priced. So I just wish you to look at your pricing. I, I suspect you might be a little bit too expensive, frankly. If I look at five grand with mm. a promoter yeah. per board per day for five hours, with yeah. 50 boards, I would rather be charging 1,500, paying my promoter 500 bucks and having all 50 billboards busy every day. Yeah. Martin, Definite. any feedback? Yeah. For me, my... My big concern is the capital outlay mm -hmm. and your numbers at the moment. Yeah. 
um, they're just not making sense. And another capital outlay that's going to be quite a, a big one is the territorial rights. Yeah. Um, I think it's going to be way more than 50,000 in territorial rights, if, if I'm correct in saying that. So, I mean, Peter, here's, here's the view that, that we have, and I think I speak for, for all the judges. Mm -hmm. You're a talented entrepreneur. We don't understand your business. And as a result, we're not going to invite you back. It doesn't mean it's a bad business, all right? I just don't quite believe in it mm -hmm. because I think you're stuck in this odd space yeah. between promoter mm -hmm. and traditional billboard, billboards. traditional yeah. advertising. It's this weird kind of in the middle space. Mm -hmm. So I'm not convinced yet. And I think maybe the solution might be the drop in pricing, all right. where you're offering more of a promotions um, you know, a, a element mm. that mm. comes with the billboard. But I don't know the answer. Mm. Right. But for that reason, I think there are entrepreneurs whose businesses we understand a little bit better, better. and maybe we lack vision. Mm. All right. um, but, but for that reason, I, I wouldn't be comfortable giving you money at this point. Mm. All right. Okay. No. Thank you for the opportunity. Mm. All the best. Thank, Thank you. The best. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Very, very second. Okay. And when he finds his, his What's a meha a little at the, but uh, I'm encouraged with the advices. Yeah, but I um, won't be making to the next round. The pricing model is not clear. We all suspect that it is overpriced, and it's not clear how. It, it is not clear how he's going to make his money. Our uh, moving billboard, uh, we're busy now signing some clients, signing some spaces and, and, and areas to, to advertise so we can give uh, brands or customers uh, more value into their their money.